At the end of Earth 2, Captain Joseph Carter was unable to extract what was left of humanity aboard the Ares Prime, a towering, N-class spaceship equipped with the most impressive technology and artificial intelligence of its time. Marooned in the vast nothingness, plagued by his thoughts of failure, with nothing but his vices, the captain changed course and now seeks signs of surviving human life. These are the stories of a sentient spaceship and a broken man. Log entry 14. Goodbye, wands. Good news. Sensors indicate we're close. Bad news is uh, can't get a visual confirmation on that landing, duck. Uh, Daisy, disengage hyperdrive. We're just going to cruise on in from here. Ares, take over. Hyperdrive disengaged. Your home wants. We're kicking you out of the band, nerd. Just kidding. Uh, I'm not sure this is the place. Yeah, sure, sure it is. You gotta trust me. The cloud coverage is too much. I still can't get any readouts. Wands, a little help. Oh, where should we go next? Just go straight down. That sounds, uh, risky. No, no. Y'all are being bad friends. Trust me. We don't exactly have the best track record, Wands. We're not gonna do that. Ares, you trust me, don't you? Don't. Don't. We're going in, Captain. Shit, hold on, Daisy. We might end up kablooed. Now's not the time to remind me. I'm a program without a tangible body. More purpose for being. Alarm. Alarm. Jurassic Park, Jurassic Park, I'm a, a dinosaur. Welcome to Blarpy Doop. Ship stable. Landing equipment error. Might want to eyeball that one on the way out, sir. Once. Safe to breathe out there for us normies? Well, clone implies we're identical to you. I mean, look at us. <laughs> You have pasta on your face. Weird. I haven't had pasta in three days. Maybe Ares put it on me when I wasn't looking. Or maybe you're just a disgusting person. Burn. Up top, Ares. Strange. A show of masculine affection from the captain. Am I detecting dangerous levels of, dare I say, friendship? Not a chance, Daze. Aww. Ooh, burn. Up top, Captain. No, you smell like fart. I'm afraid I'll catch your fart smell. I don't want to meet the natives that way. But you'll fit in. Actually, that's not a bad idea. Captain? No, no. Once, are there any customs we should be aware of before we meet the others? Nope. Heads up, though. I'm kind of popular. All my pals might be jealous, and I might have to, like, you know, pretend I'm, like, cooler than you. <laughs> you know, that, that. ooh. Daisy, lower the bay doors. We'll be back. Can I take the surrogate module? No, you're grounded, remember? But I might need you for translation, so just strap up in the rover. Aww. Well, it's time for our goodbyes. You've been a delight and a gentleman once. Yeah, it was nice knowing you, Daisy. Now you look after the little ones for me, okay? You know, in a different world, in a different time, I bet we could have been boning real good. I sense that sexual tension between us, Mm mm-hmm. Yeah, probably. Daisy. Can you blame me? Look at this hot, 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 hot body. Oh boy, sparks are flying. Some ladies are meat and potatoes kinds of gals. Not me, though. I'm a meat and bones gal. Or in case, he's just kind of bones. (laughs) Heh get it, girl. You're all terrible at sarcasm. We need more ladies on this ship. I'm surrounded by big dumb animals. Yeah, you wish I had a bone. Okay, we've had enough of you. Go on, scoot. (laughs) Oh, <laughs> <laughs>
That was heartwarming. I want to get my goodbye out of the way, too. Captain, I can barely handle this. Initiating reverse psychology mode. Get out of here. I don't love you anymore. Captain, this is hard because I do love him still. I know, buddy. I love him, too. What you do? I guess I'll stand bored since everybody wants to fuck me. Sheesh. Lowering bay doors. Hello, everyone. I'm back. Arrest them. Shit. Wands, what's this about? You are in a secure military compound. What is your clearance code? Are you aware? You are transporting a known fugitive. This makes you an accomplice. Why'd you instruct us to land in a military compound, Wands? It's the only place I've ever seen a flying ship land before. Psst, Captain. I got a plan. Get ready to get out of here. Ares, no. Shut up. Stop whatever you're planning. Place your weapons on the floor and step away from your aerial craft. I do it because I love you. Oh, shit. He's going to ram him. Yeah, it's definitely not going to work, right? Aries, you're barely held on with scotch tape. What are you doing? Take this drone scum. Maximum speed. Deploying neutralizing gas. Deploying micro EMP. Aries, you idiot. I told you not to do a dumb thing, and you went and did a dumb thing. <laughs> you're always so rude when you get gassed. You're such a, you're such a, a, a big dummy. <laughs> we're in a different scene, and now we're in court. Well, looky what we got here. A genuine real human. And he's from Earth 2. Just like you, sir. Did you rule Earth 2 humans too? <laughs> nah. Believe it or not, they ruled us. Which is kinda in turn why I rule you. They kidnapped my kind when we were babies, and raised us to protect them, and feed us from slop cans. Monsters. You're right. But, you know, we loved them for some reason. I still haven't figured out why. I mean, look at me. Look at this tail. Just bumping around like crazy. Can't get enough of these guys. Wait, wait. Kevin, focus. Wrong team. Uh, 15, inject him with the serum. What's this? Oh, it just brings you back. Yeah? Oh, hi. It's King Kaftoria. Oh, and my brother. What gives, man? <clears throat> You're on trial. For your lives. On what count? Housing fugitive. Unauthorized entry into military area. Bad attitude, I don't know, whatever. Oh, and smelling like fart. I got scared and snuck into your bed when you were sleeping last night. Damn it, Wands. Yeah, dude. It's super gross. Anyway, I'm the judge. I'm also the tyrant ruler on this planet. Also, hmm, earthly, just like you. My god, you're quirky. I'm a king. King Keftoria. Pleasure to meet you. Keftoria, I am Captain Carter of the post-Second Earth Hero Administration. I'm looking for remaining human survivors. The future of our race depends on it. Call off this trial and let's get going. Looky here, buddy boy. I'm in charge, just like my father before me. And who exactly was your father? I don't know, really. Some space tyrant? He left me here when I was a kiddo and said I needed to uh, oversee the clones and rule the planet with an iron fist and so forth and whatnot. So that's what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, oops. I'm so sorry about that. I'm a new shirt. Coffee everywhere. Uh, come on, 15. Don't make a big thing of it. Well, you know, I'm trying to look presentable and professional. We're, at, we're in court in front of my brother and stuff. 15, just cut it out, buddy. It's just coffee, okay? Well, I guess so, because you're in charge, you know, if it's just coffee, it's just coffee, but you know, I'm more wet and hot, but also I'm going to be cold in a second, because, you know... Here, I'll just lick it off of you. Ew, pervert. I've told you a million times, 14, this is normal for my people. You're always nude. No one wants to see that dong a dangling all two and or fro. Modesty is in our strong suit, got me there. But come on, you're just being ridiculous. Now, where were we? We're on trial for our lives, and I owe it all to you. Charming. Now about your, uh, infraction, so I suppose we could get a jury, but realistically, I'm just gonna get a bunch of clones, do it, say what I want, so, I mean, we could do that. Or we could just skip ahead a bit and, like, choose, looky here, like, Captain, inside this I have a contingency plan set up. Is it as good as your last plan to charge the drones in the rover? Much worse. But hey, that's the plan B, wanted or not. 
you know, like... Uh, this guy bores me. You know? Go for it. Maybe you can just help me catch Ahem. a squirrel and we can call it even. Ahem. King Keftoria. Yes, my shiny orange circular friend. What can I do for you? Do you dig the rebop? <laughs> Captain, this is where we run for it. Oh shit! Hop on, rover's faster, buddy. Goodbye, guys. Bye, ones. No, no, look, kill him. Grab him, Aries. Let's go. Bye, no. <laughs> Very good. Distraction tactic. And rebuff. They have an association with Pirates 15. I am very impressed. Well, I guess to answer your question, I do dig this. Oh gosh dang it, they're getting away. I didn't get to sentence him to throw in my squeaker. Uh, 15? Do something. I'm on it, sir. 